Drivers on PCH in Santa Monica might be looking at the bluffs more than the road, since one chunk has a massive crack that some mm. fear could crumble down. Tomorrow, the city will start an emergency project to address that bluff. And KCAL News reporter Lori Perez has details. This fissure is really something to see. It is glaring, and you can understand why city leaders want to take care of this right away and why they're calling for an emergency freeway closure starting tomorrow night so they can get down there. Look where the crack is and what stands to break off. That huge section of the bluffs is threatening to fall right onto the busy PCH below. This is something that really could cause a lot of damage. Sean James says when his friend, uh, Suzanne Yankovic, yes, Weird Al Yankovic's wife, saw something and posted this video of a glaring crack in the Santa Monica Bluffs, he knew he had to say something. You don't have much time on that freeway. If something was to fall down, there's nowhere to go. So two weeks ago, he started forwarding the jarring video of what looks like a part of the cliffs ready to drop onto PCH to community and city leaders, then to the County Board of Supervisors who called Santa Monica and said, take a look. Rick Valti is the city's public works director. We can't really pinpoint whether that will break off in a year, in 10 years, in a month or tomorrow. And he says they don't want to wait to find out. Starting Tuesday night, crews will use a crane to carefully scrape away the soil column at its weak spot without disturbing the rest of the bluffs. Valti says the unstable portion is about 4,000 cubic feet of dirt that's been compounding for thousands of years. It'll take about 15 dump trucks to haul it away. We've had a exceptionally wet winter season um, and we've noticed that quite a bit of the bluffs have sloughed off during the, the very wet winter season. He says that's why the city has had a consultant reanalyzing the bluffs since June looking for problem areas. This tip happened to come from a local and keeping in mind the devastation in Rancho Palos Verdes, Valti says they're grateful for any and all eyes that could help avoid a tragedy here. If this column were to find separation from the rest of the bluffs, you know, it's highly likely that much of it would fall onto PCH. And that could be uh, a safety concern for passengers. To safely do the work, the city will have to shut down parts of the 10 freeway and PCH. Those closures will begin Tuesday night and extend into Wednesday. You can get specifics on our website. We'll have a link to the city's closure map. In Santa Monica, I'm Lori Perez, KCAL News.